Hi everybody, it's Andrea here from Ontario Pork. We're going to be cooking up pork tenderloin that's coated in maple syrup and crushed black pepper. So let's get started with the marinade. So what I have here is a little bit of canola oil, about one tablespoon, two tablespoons of maple syrup, and right here uh, is two tablespoons of Dijon mustard, but you can also use grainy as well. Once you have that in, give it a healthy portion of some crushed black pepper, about one teaspoon, and we're just going to stir this all together. Once it's mixed up, your marinade is done. It's just that simple. So now we're going to move on to the tenderloins. In this recipe, it calls for two pork tenderloins. This will serve around six people. So we're just going to trim a little bit of the fat off. Once you trim the fat off, it actually has less fat than boneless, skinless chicken breast. So it's a very lean cut of meat. Uh, what we're taking a look at right here is the silver skin. Because once you have the silver skin off, it allows it to maintain its long shape. So once your silver skin is off and your pork tenderloin is all trimmed up, what we're going to do is we're going to place it in a Ziploc bag with the marinade. And all you have to do is just pour the marinade right in there. Once all of your tenderloin is covered, you want to put it in the fridge for at least four hours and up to 24. After that, you'll be ready to bake. Now that our tenderloins have had some time to marinate, we're going to move it into the baking dish. So a great tip when you're cooking up pork tenderloin, you want to tuck this tail end right underneath. And this will allow for even cooking. There we go. So once you have your pork tenderloin in your baking dish, you want to bake it at 400 degrees for 20 to 25 minutes, or until you've reached an internal temperature of 155 degrees Fahrenheit on the inside. So now we've taken our pork tenderloin out of the oven, and when we took it out, it registered at 155 degrees Fahrenheit. So we've tented it now, and that means that it should come up to the internal temperature of 160 degrees Fahrenheit or 71 degrees Celsius. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take our delicious pork tenderloin out, and I'm going to start carving it. So there we go, and you can see the delicious inside. And there you have it. You have delicious pork tenderloin that's been marinated in maple as well as peppercorns. Thank you for being here with me today. For these and more delicious recipes, visit ontariopork.com recipes.